Okay, pick a tractor. This one. Smash. Yoke that trailer up. Mix some of this feed with some minerals for the cows. That's what I'm desperate for at the moment. We're loaded up. I've not shown you our lambs. One, two, three, four. This lot were born about three weeks ago. This lot were born a week ago. We did have three ewes, and as you can now notice, we have two, and fortunately, one is gone. Anyway, we've got four healthy lambs. Unfortunately, yeah, one of the ewes just, the lambs were dead inside. She didn't fare too well. She's now gonna go. This trailer along the road to yard two, get it cowed, check the cows while I'm at it. Kev's managing, there was a bit of gas left in that bottle, so just making do. A bit more grinding, and I'll put the paint on a bit thicker. Jobs are good. A grinder and paint makes me the welder I ain't. That's all five rafters up over there for the joiners. <laughs> Feed cowed. That's for the cows, I'm okay for feed for the fattening cattle at the moment. That'll be that for today. Yard one bound. Right, we've just been chopping up some gussets to put onto the bell grab here, or the bell spike. There used to be a set of bell spikes for the tractor. So that was the bottom two linkages and there was a top link. It's gone. Kev's welded on this bracket there with a set of Sanderson brackets. So it's ready to lift up. Gussets to go on there, there. One on the other side, that side. One on the other side, that side. Then it just needs a buff down and a lick of paint and it's good to go. Plenty paint. Kev wants plenty paint. <laughs> yeah, it would be a good idea to try it before we finish. Huh? We'll leave Kev to it. I'm going along the road. There's a man coming to chop up some thick wood because he's got a big chainsaw. The man with a massive chainsaw has been and he's just chopped these up into manageable bits. There's another tree along the road at yard one, so he's a way to do that as well. I'll shift these all up to the yard, same way along the road, we'll get them all in one spot and he's going to come back and put them into rounds for us so we can split them. That just makes things a lot easier for us. There's a lot of wood in these bits. Fortlift can shift them, so that's the main thing. Just the way I fill a whole box with that piece. Here we go. We update on how the joiners are getting on. So these are all the uprights, all the rafters in. They've started obviously doing some purlins. There's 1500 odd of these studs. Piecing it all together, but you can get the gist of it. Feels bigger than what was kind of imagined, if that makes sense. The final layout of it all is not completed, whether what walls we're filling in, whether we're filling both sides, and obviously the entrance is going to be at that side. But the finite details are still to be decided. Just be a corrugated sheet roof with roof lights in it. We think, again, not fully decided. I think we'll need to decide pretty swift. That was a nice wee one to finish. I've got two here, I've got two along the road. It's a Baltic cold wind, I'm done. Good girl, good girl. She found one that I had no idea where it had landed. 
and she needed a wee bit of a hand finding the second. Good work dog, good work. You're getting there. I just need to keep getting out shooting. Now's the perfect time for her to learn. I can't say I've trained a gun dog properly before. We'll get you there dog, we'll get you there. That was a new box, so I've shot seven cartridges tonight, hit four birds. Not bad. Nothing happening. We've had 55 cows calf, 27 to go. Predictions, how many more sets of twins will we have? We've had 10 sets in 55 cows. So every five and a half cows, we've had a set of twins. By that maths, we're due another five or six sets. Put your predictions down below. Do you think we're past all the twins or is there more to come? Hello. I'm off to see Cammy Wilson, sheep game. I had to do a podcast with him, but I'm just about to leave. Quick check of the cows, there's one starting to calve, so I've given him a text. I need to wait and see this calf first before I go. There's not been a calf for three days, typical. Yes, gold, yeah. anyone's done a, by gold, I mean, yes, I know, but gold. yes, I know, but then that's the same for all the crops we grow. One year they might be good, the next year they might not be, so just averaging out stick, across stick the board, just yeah. keep going. You can just about make out a couple of feet coming. Voila! Well done, cow. Coughing a splutter and the calf's out. Well done, good job. Quickly spray its navel and then we're good. It's breathing away, cow's up and licking. Perfect. Nothing else is looking like it. It's about an hour and 20 down to Cammy's. Once I get there, I'll have a check of the cameras. Obviously, Dad's just two minutes on the road, so if there is anything that's desperately needing looked at, I'll give him a phone. Right, we're back from the Fed by Farmers studio. If you don't know what that is, Cammy Wilson, aka The Sheep Game, he does a podcast under the name Fed by Farmers. Podcast recorded, got a lot of time for Cammy. Good guy, always willing to divulge information and help. Waffled away for a fair while beyond the podcast, very, very open. I'll tell you anything you ask him, to be honest. It'll be out in, did he say May? Something like that. He's, he's stopping recording for lambing time, so he's getting a bit of a backlog. He's getting a bit of a back catalogue to upload. Gate lady is in the hot seat. I don't think she's ever worked that one before. Dad went away today to fetch that crepe feeder we bought in a lot, an auction lot. So that's us up one crepe feeder. We're still after an hour. It's basically 900 pound by the time you, you add in fees and whatnot. Dad had to go and get it as well. New 1300, so 400 pound less than new. And it's basically new. I'll show you around it in a bit. But... Don't say I'm not good oh, to you. A free nice hoodie. <laughs> Is it for me? Is he, it yeah, he, he charged you? me full money for that, just for you. Did he actually? No, of course he didn't. Nah, it's actually my size, it's not for you. Thanks. Oh, but it feels nice. Anyway, cheers for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. If you've not already, please like the video, please subscribe. See you tomorrow. Adios. Bye.